So, you wanna learn how to animate in Minecraft? Well, you've come to the right place, my friend. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this. You can see actually right here, you place in a lightning rod and it will animate a very nice bridge. So this is actually quite simple to do and I'm gonna show you how to do it right now and how to do it in different situations as well. So first you're gonna do slash give at p command block. This is the most important command in Minecraft. It gives you command blocks. So there's three main ways that I typically do this and that is either just the simple lever this monstrosity which is a code lock where you need a specific item like the lightning rod I just showed you or a repeating command block testing for the player. Now if you do want to know how to use this command block I do have a video on that so check it out right here but for this example we're just gonna use the simple lever as I feel like that's the most simple way to do it. Now the first step is of course to decide what you want to animate so for example I'm gonna go with the same as we had in the other world, I'm just gonna build this bridge out. Now depending on what you want, your commands might vary, so if you want to see a more detailed video on how to practically use commands, then definitely consider subscribing, because I might do a video on that very soon. But if we go with this bridge, we're gonna start off by actually getting the location of this block. So you can see my position up there in the corner, and you wanna make sure that the block you're gonna copy is one below. So if it's this block you wanna copy, for example, you should go one block below. The next thing you wanna do is write down these coordinates. Now, I would recommend in this situation to go ahead and search up a notepad, which is something that is included with every Windows software, and then write down your coordinates. And then you want to get the other side. Of course, this is going to vary depending on what you want, but I'm going to write down these coordinates, 107. So now that you have your first coordinates, you're going to want to put your command in the place that it gets a signal. So for example, this will give a signal to the command block. And in here, you're going to write slash fill and then grab your coordinates. So for me, it was the ones I already wrote down. And then you want to fill them with whatever block you want. For example, I want to have stone, specifically the sixth variant of stone, which is polished andesite. And so now you will actually see that you already have something that builds. And this is when we get to the animating part. You want to see where your next block is. Now for me, it's super simple with this bridge. I just need to check what coordinate changes. So it's 47. So then you want to hold down control and then click your middle mouse button or write in the same exact command if you're on console and then change this one to be chain always active and this is where you animate things you want it to have a delay in tick so I'm gonna do three because I feel like that fits the best for me and then you're gonna change it to whatever coordinate it was so for me it went to 47 so both of these 46 coordinates are gonna be changed to 47. And now you do that same thing until you've got what you want. So for me, it's just to put another one of these and then change it to 48 and so on. Okay, so here I have my animation. Now I'm gonna, of course, Make sure that everyone is on three ticks delay. Now I know it is because I just copied the same block over and over again. And now you will see that when we pull the lever, it is going to build a bridge. Now that I've anyway got these commands, I might as well show you how to do a staircase. And that's pretty simple. You just change your Y coordinate to being either higher, one higher or one lower. So I'm gonna change it to be one higher every time. And so now whenever I pull the lever, you will see it builds up a staircase and that is very, very nice to look at. And if you do want it to be quicker, you can always change the delay to ticks to being, for example, one. So now you can see we have this really quick staircase building. And of course, if you want it to go slower, you can always change it to a higher delay in ticks. And you can see it kind of builds up very slowly now. So that is a quick tutorial how to use this command. So since you stuck around for this long, that probably means you enjoyed the video at least a little bit. So consider subscribing. 
completely it's completely free you're gonna get a ton of cool tutorials and tips and if you stop being interested you can always unsubscribe later anyways with that said i'm gonna keep working on my withered map which is the map i'm working on right now so uh yeah i'll see you guys next time